we must understand if you add organic content to sand, sand will turn into soil. If you remove all organic content from the soil, soil will become sand. In normal agricultural soil, the minimum organic content should be between three to six percent. The most minimum is three percent. At least this minimum to keep the soil alive, to keep the soil as living soil. I think the three percent minimum is something I've been pushing for the last forty years. Um, so, uh, I've been causing trouble for a while. <laughs> three percent is, is kind of the, the borderline where you've got enough diversity in the kinds of foods that are present so that all of the necessary sets of microorganisms will be able to perform their jobs at the right time and in the right place. And people don't think about the fact that every growing season is different from every other growing season you've ever encountered. It's hot or cold or wet or dry or some combination of different abiotic factors. How much sand, sand and clay do you have? How available is um, are those nutrients tied in the sand, silts and clays for your microorganisms to be able to pull them out? You've got to have all of that diversity of food. Right now, agricultural soils across the world, the depletion is so heavy. In most countries, more than 50% of the topsoil is already gone in the last hundred years. So here we are, if we want to exist well, if we want future generations to exist well, the most important thing we need to do is, we have to enshrine in the policy making of our world, in the policy making of all nations on the planet, that soil is a legacy that we have received from the past and we must pass it on as living soil for future generations. This is a generational responsibility that all of us owe to life on this planet. We need to galvanize a large number of people, at least sixty percent of the electorate, which amounts to three to three point five billion people. Only if we do this, democratically elected governments will have the courage and the focus to invest in regenerating soil, making policies and budgets for soil regeneration. Be a part of this and let us make it happen.